think this is a... baddies welcome and welcome back to my channel so in today's video we're gonna be doing a uh, new lipsticks for mm, is it for women of color i guess it's women of color or is it deeper skin tones questions that need answers but this is all my favorite new lipsticks that i like to wear so if you guys would like to see my favorites stay tuned and don't forget to like comment subscribe So that's this combo. And I've been using Ferris Nude for a long time, like since. Who taught me about Ferris Nude? I don't know who told me about it, but I've been, I usually remember, like I remember who told me about this lipstick. I usually remember, but I've been using this since high school. I can't remember which YouTuber. I really wish I could remember. Whenever, if I remember, I'll put it down in the description box. So that's that combo. So a lot of these lip combos, I do like to switch up which glosses I top them off with. So it's really interchangeable, uh, you know. I'm gonna try to stay away from repeating glosses so y'all can see how the gloss will change it up. But this is like actually one of my favorite lip looks to do today. This is the Revlon Super Lustrous Lipstick. And this is in the shade Mink. And y'all, my homegirl, she's not really my homegirl. <laughs> but I've been watching her since I was in high school. So that's my homegirl technically. Thomas Adriana actually put me onto this lipstick. And ever since, I've been always buying this lipstick. Because honestly, before I even knew about um, lining my lips, I used to wear this by itself. Right, electric chair. Oldie but a goodie, okay. But I love like a really bright nude. That and I use my L'Oreal lip color and this is in the shade I Dare to line my lips with i wouldn't buy that shade as a lipstick i bought it just to use it as a lip liner which it's doing a pretty good job it's giving what it needs to give
And so this last Smithy is going to be all crayon case products. First two are the Rule Breakers. I'm lining my lips with Dante. I'm surprised I ain't talked to nobody named Dante. TBH. <laughs> okay, let's get back to the bubbles, okay? So, this is a look. This is a look team mask because it's all matte. Like, it's not going to rub off. But for my baddies that love the glossy lips, aka me. Um, so I'm going to show you guys with this crayon case lip gloss I have. This one is usually a little lighter, but I feel like with me putting it on on top of my lippies, it's darkened the shade uh, definitely. Yeah, it's definitely got darker because it was a little lighter. <laughs> and my girl is going empty, child. We're scraping the bottom. And I'm going in with my Lime Crime Wet Cherry Lip Gloss. I kind of stained that other lip gloss bottle, so I'm just going to put it on the back of my hand and rub it on my lips to make it have that extra shine. Do that too so you can get that extra gloss on right there so it won't have that, that sticky effect. So I have Sable and Coffee Bean. Let me, I'll swatch them for you. Coffee Bean is more of a purple, like more of a purpley brown. And Sable is more warm toned, I guess. Just to help it blend a little better. And honestly, you don't need a gloss on top of this. I don't know why. I think this is a... I think this is already a lip gloss because it's called the lip glass so it has like the glass effect aka the clear so baddies that's just a few of my favorite new lip glosses but if you guys enjoyed this video like and then comment down below a lipstick tube comment down below a lipstick tube and let me know y'all watched it to the end okay so if my baddies made it to the end of this video i'm doing a giveaway milani sent me their color fetish shine lipstick so if you guys would like to win this Comment down below the lipstick emoji, the diamond emoji, and your Instagram at name. And screenshot this video and post it on your Instagram stories and tag me, okay? So make sure you like and subscribe. Comment down below the lucky emojis. Bye, baddies. Until next time.